right, y'all. So today we are going to be reacting to my video slash 30 minute documentary uh, about me from a film crew that came out to come see me uh, a few weeks ago. So from where was Denmark. this film? Okay. I'm getting to that, Barry. Sorry. Give me a second. I, I just wanted to make sure. Ah. Okay, so to make a long story short, Denmark has a relatively equal media. They are forced to show both sides of the aisle and to show all the different perspectives. And so a few years ago, back in 2020, they actually reached out to me to talk about me with the 2020 election. Life just didn't work for anybody because, you know, COVID. So this year they reached out again and they said, hey, we still want to do that little documentary about you and your life. So can we come visit you from Denmark? And of course we were like, yeah, sure, why not? So this is the video. It got released on Super Tuesday and we're going to react to it. I've already seen it, but Barry hasn't. So and just FYI, this was like like a government, like Denmark's governmental media. Like yeah. this goes out to everybody. It's kind of like all of the C-SPAN, entire... something like that that no, just records MP... everything. Maybe. No, no. This is more like an NPR Vice NPR, style. Vice. This is NPR uh, Vice. Not Vice. No, what Vice was originally. Vice is not anymore. Debunked. Yeah, no, Vice NPR. is NPR. But like what uh, it was originally where they would just do yeah. stories on people. And so that's what this was, was there was two dudes that came out and basically a journalist and a cameraman came and filmed Savannah and basically, yep, basically a week, and a, week in, a week in her Shout life. Shout out! So, but anyway, so here's the video. Actually, uh, I haven't seen any of this. Um, Very. But yeah. Play. So. There you go. Sit farten ned. Jeg lærte at skyde, fordi min far ville have. Okay, I still have no idea what they're saying. Jeg skulle kunne forsvare mig. Well, they're subtitles. På landet i Texas. Oh wait, that's the parade. I put subtitles on. You do. It took totally a long enough. time, by the way, to put subtitles. Vi indtog vesten med benhår, cowboys og cowgirls. Som red på heste og havde pistoler og så døden i øjnene og sagde. Ikke i dag. Hey, go! Friheden er muligheden for at tage ansvar for sig selv, familien og kristne værdier. That horse, her Savannah name is håber Pat. på fire år mere med Donald Trump, fordi han lader hende gøre lige præcis, som hun vil. Heste, rodeo, skydning til hest og kunne gøre alt det her. Det er noget af det bedste her, og at jeg kan gøre det med dem, jeg elsker. Og at ingen siger, hvornår jeg må og ikke må gøre ting. De eneste fester til regnskab over for er Gud og min far. Goddag, hej, kom indenfor. Velkommen. FYI, he is doing translations of kind of what kind of what I said. Well, who he's interviewing. I, it looks like, and and uh, also he's also doing his own commentary, but this should be also slightly translating because not everyone over there speaks English. Exactly. Oh, so. Hey Sherman, I can hear you birthday. Then die. Family and my There goes my dog. Open door, and of course they run out. This is Savannah, little brother, and their parents. They are all together, upcalled after war crisis generals. Hunden er opkaldt efter generaler, og kattene efter pistoler. Heste giver mig fred. Jeg tror, Gud satte dem på jorden for at fortælle os, hvad kærlighed er. Savannah er 19 år, og en helt almindelig teenager. Hun er en slags politisk provokatør, yeah. og så træner hun hårdt cool for at blive en rodeo-stjerne. Really jeg vil gerne se mit navn med alle de professionelle, som er mine helte. Og måske kunne konkurrere på deres niveau en dag. Jeg forventer ikke, at politikere skal gøre mit liv nemmere. For så vil jeg aldrig få gjort noget. Du ser så ikke happy. Var du ikke vandt? Was just writing. I'm focused. Jeg betragter ikke mig selv som republikaner, men som patriot. Det eneste, jeg går op i, er frihed og livskvalitet. Yeah. 
Savannas far, Chet, har gjort tjeneste i den amerikanske flåde i 30 år. Familien betyder alt her. Vi har hjemmeundervist vores børn og opdraget dem i den kristne tro. Shannon arbejdede, indtil vi fik børn. Hun stoppede, så hun kunne være hos dem døgnet rundt. Jeg var ikke så vild med de offentlige skoler. Jeg sagde, at Gud har en plan med deres liv. De skal undervises i videnskab ud fra et kristent perspektiv. Hjemmeundervisning gjorde, at Savannah kunne sy og have et firma. Ja, mit liv kredser om mine børn. Og det gør det stadigvæk. Det er fint. It's Indy! Kan du komme ind i traileren? Du behøver ikke at tage dig af alle mine ting. Oh yeah! Love that sign. Vi er en fast sammentømret flok. Mine venner og jeg er på vej til Cowtown Coliseum i Fort Worth. For at deltage i rodeoen på min nyeste hest, Independence. Ham fyren, der ville danse med dig i baren. Du spurgte ham, hvem han stemte på, og udspurgte ham om politik. Han sagde bare, glem det. Du skræmmer dem væk. Du siger Donald Trump, og så siger de nej. Skal vi parkere her? Oh my gosh, parking that night was literally insane. The rodeo ground was so full. Kan du bare smide af traileren? Jeg leder efter en hård strile. For frøken kaos er smurt ind i mudder, og der skal en metalstrile til. Om lidt skal Savannah se, om træningen har virket. Hun håber på at slå sin egen personlige rekord. Hvis jeg kan gøre det på 15, og mit hårde arbejde betaler sig, er jeg glad. Before this night on this horse, I had only ever run a 15. That was God, prima donna. Lad os fejre det amerikanske flag med stolthed. She's just a baby, and she's For det still learning. For de fris land, de tager pres hjem. So we're working our way up. Amerikas forenede stater. Hernede yeah, har vi sværet troskab mod flaget. Flag. Og vi beder før alle vores sportsbegivenheder. Hvorfor har du pink tøj på? So... Indy er en Barbie-hest. Hendes farve er pink. Kan du guys tell what my favorite color is? Isn't it green? Er jeg urolig og spændt, og jeg har virkelig nerver på. Oh, do you guys see that other devil for a horse right there? That is the rodeo. Which horse? The that one that was to the right in the shot. She's out of screen right now. But that one horse, that rider's name is Cassie Mowry. Right there. That horse with the butt. The one that looks like Indy. There you go. She's a pro rodeo athlete. I got to race against her. Freaking awesome. Sorry, continue. Right. Jeg er urolig og spændt, og jeg har virkelig nerver på. Jeg vil bare gøre mit bedste for at ride min hest, sådan som hun fortjener. Hvor var det? Barry, look, there's you! You made it on. What do you friggin' do? <laughs> kan du sætte computeren på den grønne? Hvad med at lave en flætning i siden? Så kan man se, at du har hår. Rør mig ikke. Sjønge. The subtitle said nautical miles. <laughs> It's not, uh, I just, again, I don't know. I can, I'm no Dutch. Which is what we're doing here today. Vi skal tale om grænseloven, som giver flere penge til grænser i Ukraine end vores eget land. Det var meget snak. Hvorfor gør vi det ikke, mor? Så er det til sociale medier. De er blevet set af millioner, men også blevet delt af kendte konservative debattører. Og Donald Trump selv. 
hvis du har boet under en sten eller ignoreret skrål halvsene i kongressen. I søndags kom der endnu et latterligt udgiftslovforslag fra de idioter, der af en eller anden grund blev valgt. Savannah er svær at styre, hun er fyrig. <laughs> Yep, Did thanks. you read that? It says it said you're difficult to manage and fire. Yep. I wouldn't say you're difficult to manage. You just no. That's what my dad said. You just okay. Well, okay. All right. It just you do make things a. I guess you do kind of make things difficult. But I I hmm. find it. Fun. It's who you are though. It's your personality. Yeah. It spices right things up. Hun er smuk ligesom sin mor, men hun er også stedig og går meget op i politik. Very stubborn, very politically minded, like her dad. Very opinionated. Savannas politiske arbejde startede i frustrationen over Venstrefløjens ønske om at fjerne statuer af borgerkrigsgeneraler. Jeg vil kommentere fjernelsen af General Lee statuen. Oh, it says it down there. General Lee gjorde mere end nogen anden politiker eller militærleder fra syden. I was reading the subtitle. From the south. For en fredelig overgang fra krig til fred. Transition from war to peace. Der er ingen tvivl om, at slaveriet var Amerikas største synd. You with your dog collar. You know what? I wore them in memory of my dead dogs, so leave me alone. I was 12. Vi har vigtigere at diskutere, såsom uddannelse, infrastruktur, fattigdom og vores sikkerhed. Ja, min mor og far hjælper mig med det her, men jeg ved, hvad jeg taler om. Reaktionerne på hendes synspunkter kom prompte. Da de kom ud til parkeringspladsen, oh, var der øget herværk på vores I, uh, my mom. Vi bor i et land, hvor en på 16-20 år ikke kan have et politisk synspunkt, uden at blive angrebet på grund af det. De sidste fire år har jeg igen og igen hørt folk fra Joe Bidens stab sige, at grænsen er sikker og at den er bedre end længe. USA vil blive ved med at håndhæve vores love og sikre vores grænse. Grænsen er sikker. 221.000 migranter krydsede grænsen til USA i sidste måned. I har haft fire år til at løse det, og I har ignoreret det. For kun konservative, patrioter og republikanere går op i det. Det var det, Donald Trump kæmpede så hårdt for at forsvare. Nok om idioterne i Washington, kind of. DC. <laughs> A lot more than any other president, but kind of. Blah, blah, blah. Hey, look, it's my favorite gun store. You know that thing that I was talking about earlier where my hand print the property all over them gum? Yeah, this place. Wait, what? Earlier when I was talking about my fingerprints being on the thing. It's not part of this video. I'm telling you, Barry. The audience can just... Demi sort of vid. Yeah, yeah, den har jeg sort. I'll watch the video, I guess. Somebody liked it. Yep, yeah, I sold that one. Jack Nabbit, Dave, you sold my favorite. So, Savannah. Is this how you dress every day when you go out? No! <laughs> they wanted me to wear. I understand. I just find it funny that they had you just wear like your they were like, get up, like your full blown. Uh, okay. Okay. Jacob like loved beskyttelse. these sparkly Texas shaped earrings. <laughs> so they were like, you have to wear these earrings. Nu må man bære so I had to wear. To wear the only time I've seen you that is when you spoke at. Yeah, because they're like really mean. Yeah. The only time I saw you ever wear. Them. And then this shirt here. Grant, I don't see you every day, but, well, but yeah, anyway. very. But that shirt there was actually a shirt that Dave got me uh, back when he was my high school radio. I don't know who that is. But the dude who owns the shop. Oh, okay. He got me that shirt. Oh, okay. And then that hat is an eighteen hundred dollar like beaver. So that's why I wore the hat. Han har gjort meget for at komme af med en masse regler. Yes. This hat is eighteen hundred dollars. It's like a ten x hat. It's it's really. I don't know what that means, but. Okay, how many X's are in a hat is like the quality like of the. Like an extra large hat because I wear an extra no, 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 large no, no. hat. No, 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 it's I not know. the size. It's the quality I, I of like the fur that. that they use. So like a one X is the cheapest. It can go all the way up to like an hundred X hat. Like some of them are crazy expensive. And this is only ten. I think I so, I can't remember. It's so beaver. The quality of or is the, it mink? I don't remember. The quality of the. Felt hats. The fabric, Felt I guess. cowboy hat. And it's eighteen hundred for. I never paid that. That was given to me as a yeah. high school rodeo sponsorship because they loved what I did with my Jesus. politics. So they were like, "We want to support you with a hat." So it's. I didn't know cowboy hats were that. Are you kidding? That's insane. 
Some of them are literally like you could buy a car. Those are for like the Yellowstone people, though. That's not the point. Eighteen hundred dollars oh is is like. Yes, I that's know. More I'm than blessed the, that's in the more than most department. people's rent a month. I know. Like more, a lot of people's mortgages. In this hat was actually custom molded to my head too. So. Så det skal de ordne igen, når han kommer tilbage. Jeg har skrevet en bog. Ja. Jeg har ville give dig et eksemplar, og jeg bliver ved med at glemme da jeg kom, var du her ikke, og så huskede jeg det. Har du signeret? What? Okay, this is my gripe about... I understand stuff like this needs to happen, okay? For the video. But this is 100% staged. It feels staged. I know it's staged. It's just like uh, okay. So you would would you have ever really given him that book because it's yes. not? I have actually been meaning to give him that book for weeks, but okay. every time right. I went well, okay. to the then, store, then, then I stand corrected. He okay. wasn't there, or I forgot the book. So when we went to go visit him Sunday after church, we were like, "All right, today we're going to give him the book because that'll make a cool scene for the video." So okay. yeah, we did plan it. Okay, well, but I had actually been meaning. to I was give thinking him it's one. like it's not his genre. I don't think he's gonna enter. No, he's not. That. But I don't know if you noticed, so. but he had my picture hanging up in there. I saw. And he now has the book. Just yeah, but, up there. but that's just because that's because he knows you and and. and well, he everybody. just likes me and he supports me. He's not yeah. even a big reader, but I just wanted so. to give him a copy of my book. No, I, I understand. He supported you. Never gave me a copy of your freaking book. You know, thanks. I appreciate this guy didn't ask for it. <laughs> Thanks. You want a copy? That. Oh my gosh. No, oh. I don't want a copy because I don't want a pity one because I don't, I'm not, uh, uh, yeah. Fine. No. I'm not going to give you a copy. Oh crap. You can go buy a copy, yeah, Barry. I see how it is. 20 bucks. Buy yeah. a copy. I see what it's I'm going to do. It's an extra five. We're done. We're done after this. F this. This is bull crap. I'm not, I'm not wanted at all. Oh. Appreciate oh. that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Look, I even signed it. I even offered to do a whole ah. audio oh. garbage with you. Jarvis, stop it. Min bog handler om en ung kvinde, der beslutter at kæmpe mod det overnaturlige og sikre retfærdighed for dem, der føler sig svigtet af systemet. Det lyder meget som dig. Og forsiden ligner mig. Det var ikke min hensigt. Jeg var træt af at læse bøger, der ikke havde en stærk kvindelig hovedperson. Er det MP40 op der? Manden var stærk og kvindelig svag. Det er som en World War II gang der. Jeg har støttet hende, siden hun gik i high school og bliver ved med det. Jeg ved, hvad hun står for, og vi har brug for flere, der kæmper for det. Min mor er så, åh oh, gud. That's a fabulous ponytail right there. Ægte trone går ikke kun i kirke om søndagen. Om mandagen går Savannah og vennerne i bibelskole med præsten i den lokale cowboykirke. I vers 27 i kapitel 1 står der, at Gud skabte mennesket i sit billede. Som mand og kvinde skabte han dem. Har I tænkt på, at I havde et formål for? I'm sorry, seeing myself, I'm just like nogen. staring at me like, what am I doing? Han viste os i begyndelsen af det, vi kalder Bibelen, skabelsesberetningen. Hvordan man har et forhold, hvordan man indgår i et forhold. Verdens opfattelse af, hvad et forhold er, er alt for flydende. There's Thomas's head. Alle andre opfattelser af, hvordan Gud skabte mennesket. Og af forhold, alle andre opfattelser end Bibelens er ugudelige. Kørmand! Kør. Kom her! Du missede. Jeg sound like a jerk. Story. They all bully me for not being able to rope. So when I actually like Donald Trump get it pretty well. Vi skal ikke bedømme om han er en sand kristen. Jeg er ikke Gud, så jeg ved det ikke. Men jeg håber og beder til at han finder frelse.
efter det sidste valg købte min kone og jeg de her guldbelagte 1911 ære. De her 45 kaliber 1911 Trump-pistoler. Her står der, stolt af at være bedrøvelig. Bougie Barry. We got deplorable guns. Det gjorde berømt af tidligere udenrigsminister Clinton. Texas-logoet er på den ene side. Donald Trump-logoet er på alle pistolerne. Der står, vi er muren. Vi er the wall. En lille souvenir. Jeg håber, de stiger i værdi ved det næste valg. I sin karriere kom Chad helt tæt på den øverste ledelse i det amerikanske militær. Jeg har været assistent for stabschefen for de væbnede styrker. Og militærassistent for to forsvarsministre. Det var Bob Gates og Leon Panetta. Deres mønter står i forreste række der. Var nogen begyndt at spise? Nej. Herre, tak for vores dag og vores families tid sammen. Må Sauvi få en tryg rejse. Hjælp vores land. I Jesu navn. Amen. Hvor er krabbetipsene? Det er krabberne. Hvor er sovsen til dumpling gerne? Hvor ofte spiser I sammen? Altid til aftensmad. Din tidligere arbejdsgiver, Bob Gates, har sagt, at han frygtede, at Trump var en trussel mod landets sikkerhed. Hvordan har du det med, at han har sagt det? Who's Bob Gates? Why do I know that? Trump er en trussel mod etablissementet på begge sider. Det får bare os til at tænke, at hvis begge sider ikke kan lide ham. Everyone knows måske Bill Gates, om Donald Trump. Bob Gates was like... Oh, I don't den anden for He's det, like the gør, boss, så de ikke kan vende the det mod dig. Det er so they can never turn it back on you. Det, det, de gør mod Donald Trump. Det er en heksejagt. It's going down a rabbit hole. It's a witch hunt that they know they'll never get the end of. Hvis det er en heksejagt, er ret mange dommere her i landet korrupte. Pretty sure. De har rejst tiltale mod Donald Trump. Der er 91 anklagepunkter. Så du So, is Bob Gates the equivalent to what Petraeus was? Because I remember Petraeus. Sorry, who? General Petraeus. Is that who Bob Gates was? No, he's a part of... Okay, well... Because it said it was his former okay. employer is what he's saying. So I'm assuming it was like... Dad, I'm sorry if I say this wrong, but he is um like the Secretary of Defense. He's a part of the Department of Defense. So he is so the like Secretary the of Defense top is usually... dude. I understand that. But so General Petraeus had some scandal with like... Uh, infidelity or something like that. I think in like the 15 in like 2014 or something like that. But he was like the general, general person. But I don't think he was a secretary of defense because the secretary of defense is typically a congressperson, usually. I thought I could be wrong. I don't remember. Anyway, it doesn't matter. I never I, met the dude. Why. I'm not entirely know. sure. All I know is that he was the secretary of defense. Gotcha. Okay. Like I just don't recall. Back like 10 years ago. Yeah. Yeah. That was my dad like the to the gang. Of my dad's career. So that would have been like om det er republikanere eller demokrater. I don't know who it is anymore. Det er amerikanere, at vi ikke har tillid til vores regering. Jeg tror, vi skal. Hvis vi bliver ved med konstant at tvivle på vores folkevalgte, har landet måske modet til at fortsætte de næste generationer. Some black dude named Lloyd Austin these days. Cool. Didn't know that. Oh, look! This is me sewing my Snow White corset for the cosplay convention. That just happened. Yeah, that literally just happened Saturday. Spoiler, I won. Min bedste mor havde en brudebutik. Hun lærte mig at sy brudekjoler til American Girl dukker. Jeg elsker at sy og begyndte at lave mine egne kostumer. Nogen spurgte, om jeg ville komme til fødselsdagsfester. I mit kostumeskab har jeg en million. Det her var sjovt at lave. Jeg havde det på til en konkurrence og Jeg havde det på til en konkurrence og vandt for bedste udklædning. Lige nu gør jeg mig klar til at være Rapunzel. 
to get ready to be Rapunzel. Team Prinzessin for the stage. Just imagine all the hours of editing that the person had to go and edit. Yeah, four more. That's simply so bad. That's the stuff that takes all the freaking time. Many beloved Disney princesses have fallen. Look, I'm Mega Mind. A great look for you. And princesses. You should rock that up. I do. I do. Isn't that party time for the wig? You would not go to the grocery store like that. Barry, I've gone to the grocery store dressed up as full Rapunzel when that I understand, gets too but itchy. I don't think you would do it in that, that wig. Yes, I would. <laughs> and then all of a sudden, all you see is a bald head. They kind of do suck. Barry, I will literally go put a wig cap on and walk around. I could care less. What's wrong with what Disney's doing right now? That's me and my mom leaving. They are leaving. She's stop with us because my children. And making it look like if you are, you know, the white. Princesse. Er man et dårligt menneske eller en undertrykker? Rapunzel. Hvordan har du det, når du bliver beskyldt for racisme? Jeg griner af det, for de tager fejl. Men hvis man klynker og ser sig selv som et offer, og konstant klager over, at alle andre gør ens liv svært, skal man blive voksen, for verden er barsk. Oh my gosh, how crazy my hair is. Savannas mor viser nogle af de tusindvis af trusler. All right, PSA, at this point, we're about to start saying some very graphic stuff, so if you don't like this, like, skip ahead a whole bunch. Fordi der er så meget had i det her. Even I don't like listening to it. Jeg har lyst til at lægge min... FYI. Yes. This stuff is like the vile garbage that goes on Savannah. I don't know how much they're going to show of this. Oh, they show so much. I would assume Denmark's a lot more relaxed. They don't censor nothing. Like nothing. Every single word is about to be said, and nothing is bleeped out. So. It's yeah. So it, it might be thirty seconds to a minute and a half or something like that. But Fair some, there's some vile stuff, and it's not even the worst stuff that you've gotten. No, this is just but what my mom okay. ended so, up reading. And it is funny because she keeps binders of this, like printed out. I do. No longer, that funny. she doesn't do it anymore because um, it got so bad where yeah. she was like, okay. But what she has is is like several binders. Is my Yes, there are several three-inch thick binders filled with paper. There are several three-inch thick binders filled with paper. There are several three-inch thick binders filled with paper. There are several three-inch thick binders filled with paper. There are several three-inch thick binders filled with paper. There are several three-inch thick binders filled with paper. There are several three-inch thick binders filled with paper. There are several three-inch thick binders filled with paper. There are several three-inch thick binders filled with paper. There are several three-inch thick binders jeg elsker dig, din klamme republikanske dronning. Eller det her. Jeg vil knippe dig så hårdt, at du vil tække mig om at stoppe. Hvor mange beskeder, som du har du fået? So vile, but so unoriginal. Det er kun nogle af dem. Your mom even has tabs of like what is what. Like it's insane to me. She has tabs of like who created fake profiles and was saying stuff pretending to be me versus who was saying just vile, awful stuff, and then who is like death threatening, rape threatening. So bare kom an. All of that. Come and take it. Derfor står der på skiltet ved døren. Vi ringer ikke et hundrede og tolte. Hvad gør I? Yeah, yeah, mama. Kom og find ud af det. Det vil jeg sige til alle dem, der tror hende. To all of those. That's my mom's favorite. Threaten her because of what she has to say. And she means it. Stille og roligt. Brug dit sæde. Pres. Gør klar til at sidde. Sid, sid. Sådan. Hi was getting pissed at me this day. It was cold and she hadn't been ridden for like two weeks. Hi is the worst, right? Hi is the worst, yeah. Hi is the worst, yeah. And you know, gas is unavailable anymore. Vil heste være et ret godt transportmiddel? Vi har brugt dem i hundrede af år, og vi er gået over til biler. I mean, I'm just saying. Hvis det har siden tiden, så må vi have tre. Jeg er gonna go ride around town. Må han vide noget om det? Så er det ikke godt. Kunne du lide den? Ja, den var sjov. Hvordan vil Donald Trump bevare jeres måde at leve på? Det er selve ideen om Trump. Yeah, FYI, this is like a, what the vice declaration was in the beginning. So, they were good. Or is... 
Men vi gør, hvad vi vil i Texas. Når regeringen beslutter at blande sig i alle aspekter af hans liv, får man et samfund med konstante spændinger. Hvad er det? I mean, like, laser sharks, Berlin Wall, like... <laughs> Your brother was going full conspiracy? Well, not conspiracy. It was just like, okay, my family, like, we're not afraid to, like, disagree with each other on anything. And sometimes we purposely do it just to piss the other one off <laughs> or just to see what the other one would argue. Gee, you and, and so, I have never done that before. Fucker. <laughs> well, this ended up being one of those dinners. So it was a pretty uh, realistic dinner in the Meisner household. So it wasn't but... just hamming it up for the camera. No, though. it was legit. And Jakob was like, uh. Because <laughs> they were so confused. I was like, no, this, this is normal. But please don't put that in there. Og til sidst bliver folk så vrede, at de gør oprør. Hvis Trump kommer i det hvide hus igen, lader de os være i fire år. Så får vi måske fire gode år igen. The rodeo! Det er finally show the, the, the run, that's important. Yeah. They made it to where like they showed what had happened at the very beginning. This little girl is a well, freaking ant, by the way. Well, don't tell me. I mean, we're going to see it. Her. There's me and my little fuzzy bestie. Look at her go. Look at that little part. På vej ind begynder mit hjerte at hamre. She's putting the ears in airplane mode. Jeg kan ikke mærke mine fingre og tæer har sommerfugle i maven. Men min hest og jeg stoler på hinanden, og vi vil gøre vores bedste som et hold. Første Go, girl! Kom I did not så. drop my hand. Sådan en mere. Run, little gray mare, run! 14 a. 14.883. And you wanted 14. You wanted lower than 14. No, I wanted lower than 15. Det var fantastisk. Well, that's why. Well, I'm just saying your last one was 14.5. That's a big improvement. No, my last one. Og jeg er så stolt af den her hest. Okay, that's why. I'm sorry. Yeah, you're right. I'm sorry. Yeah. Det havde jeg slet ikke forventet. Nothing that I expected. Selvom jeg begik fejl flere gange. Messing up a few times, which I did. Jeg lagde ikke hånden på den første tynde. Gjorde hun det fantastisk. She still did amazing, and that's by far. It's her fastest run ever, and I'm so happy. I'm literally so excited right now. I screamed when I got to the end. I heard my time, and I scared the gate guy and the tractor driver. I didn't fail, but she ran it on the 14th of August. It was wild. That was crazy. See, for me. All right, you guys, look at me. It was memorable time. They ended it with me winning. In my heart. The girl who actually won the rodeo ran a 13.5 just for context. So I was in the 3D, but I you cannot have. What is 3D? That. What does that mean? It means I was in the third division. Oh. So I was like basically middle of the pack, but I was still so freaking happy because this is a very young horse, and that was only her like ninth time competing, and I was very happy with her. So. so. That was interesting. I know. It was really, done really well. I know. It was, it was really fun to watch. Well, that's our reaction to Denmark's interpretation of who is the country conservative Texas Christian conservative. cowgirl yeah. from America in her 20s who's just not listening to anybody and does what she wants. And that, that's what Denmark now thinks of us. So you're welcome for giving Denmark a, a good interpretation of America. Whatever. Anyway, see y'all later. Tune in next time for another video of whatever Barry and I decide to do next. Okay.